Don't forget that WEYW and 104.9 The X are sponsoring a Christmas decorating contest. We are looking for the most creative house in South Florida. Please send photos or a video of the outside of your home to the email address that you see on the bottom of the screen. The winner will receive a two-night stay at the beautiful Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages. All right, before we go today, I'm going to leave you with a song that was written by local singer-songwriter Scott Mastro. Scott, thank you for being here with me thank this morning. Thank you for having me here on the, on the final Monday before the end of the world. <laughs> <laughs> before the end of the world. Oh, man, right? That's what they say, don't they, Scott? Mm -hmm. Yes. And you have a song about it. Yes. Don't send any Christmas cards this year because, of course, on Friday, the world's going to end because that's what the Mayans say. <laughs> it worked out so well for the Mayans, they must know what they're talking about. So here we go. Well, there isn't gonna be any need for a Christmas tree. According to the Mayan calendar, I fear. The world is going to end for you and me, my friend. So don't send any Christmas cards this year. Hey, if the Mayans got it right, and a sleigh will sail from sight And everything on earth will do that too And we will not be alive Come December 25 Don't send any Christmas cards this year Don't send any Christmas cards this year don't mix up a batch of eggnog to try to bring some Christmas cheer. And don't be decking the halls, cause there won't be any walls. Don't send any Christmas cards this year. Now a lot of Mayan faces will be red. If we are not all dead, exactly when the Mayans say we'll Appear. So it's best to be prepared Drinking tequila shots from a potty's table in a barber chair Don't send any Christmas cards this year Now for crazy Uncle Cliff Don't buy that fool a gift For blue haired Auntie Claire She'll be fire and ash and air Mayans ripped out people's hearts and sacrificed them to the sun. Oh, go ahead, send your Christmas cards, but you'll be the only one. You'll look like a fool using that writing tool. Sending season's greetings out to neighbors, family, and friends. It's no joke. There's no pun, I got it from an ancient one. December 21st is when this cruel world ends. Maybe just because there won't be no Santa Claus. Don't send any Christmas cards this year. But let's revel in the season of the spirit of the Olive Branch Christmas Dove. Don't send any Christmas songs, but let's make peace. And don't send any Christmas cards, but let's make peace. And skip the low fat yogurt and have another beer. Don't send any Christmas cards, don't covet Christmas decorations in other people's yards. Don't send any Christmas cards this year. about that. No Christmas cards this year. You're wasting money. Who knows it best? <laughs> and it's, this is a very good week to borrow money. Uh, okay. Borrow like, you, like you're part of the government or something. Or just like you're just... <laughs> just so Don't take his advice too seriously, okay? Yeah, <laughs> no, Scott, great song. And it, wait, let me just, at the end, you said cut low-fat yogurt. 
Skip the low-fat yogurt and have another beer. It doesn't uh, matter. Okay. You know? <laughs> go for it. Just tell everybody what you really think of them. Mm -hmm. uh, and like I said, borrowing the money thing's a good idea. And just do what you go want. Go for it. Walk around in your underwear or whatever <laughs> you want to. <laughs> oh, Scott. Well, if anybody wants more information on Scott, they can shoot him an email that you see on the bottom of the screen. Scott, thank you for being on. And thank you. You sir. just moved down to the Keys recently. Yeah. You also have written a book, yeah. which we're going to have you on another time to talk all about that. You can plug it real quick if you uh, want. It's a book called, uh, it's a book of short stories with a real publisher. Mm -hmm. uh, it took a long time to get published, so I am proud of it. It's a good book. It's a book of 14 short stories called uh, Blood Money, Tales of Two Continents, and you can read the first story on Amazon.com. Mm -hmm. Blood Money, Tales from Two Continents, international stories from around the world. I'm sure that you'll get a lot of laughs if you check out that book. I, there are some. There are actually some funny people in that book. <laughs> funny people in that book. Surprise. Great things in your song as well. Scott, thank you for being on this mu thank morning, you. sharing your music with us. Everybody, thank you for tuning in today. I hope you can join me back here tomorrow at 7 a.m. and then 8.30 a.m. Take care and have a great rest of your day.